YouTube, I'm once again back with uh, the long haul in seven days, and it's uh, dawning on the day of 27. We're not too far from the horde, uh, been doing some stuff overnight, working on making a new blunderbuss to merge with the old one. Got some zombies to deal with, and uh, one thing I realized was, like, I'm out of, uh, I'm out of iron already. Which is a little concerning, but... Ah, uh, it's no real, it's no real big deal, it's a... It's... It, I can get that easy enough. I just... Get my bearings set together, like, uh, cause it's been a couple days since I streamed this world. Okay, just gotta clear these guys out. Come here! Everybody gets a, gets a looking. There you go. Use a nice spike club, which unlocked a, uh, a day or two ago. I honestly don't remember. I think it was a traitor. Like, I got out of traitor act. I'm gonna search these zombies up really quickly. Our weapons and tools are looking pretty good. I that uh, the spike club, the weaponsmithing's over 300. We're putting stuff together. And yeah, our wrench is looking nice. SMG's looking good. I got almost 500 rounds of that stuff. But, I am trying to do... What I'm trying to do now is, uh, I want to grab some... I want to merge that blunderbuss together, and, well, I do have plenty of gunpowder. But, the well, one thing that's, like, the thing I'm constantly lacking on is, uh is uh, small stones. So, yeah, I'm gonna have to collect some more of those. Still got more zombies hanging out. Come here. Um, uh, you're done. We got Curly, along with Annie. Come here, guys. We'll just take care of these really quick before we go check up on the base. Gotta do a little bit of a status check on it. Okay. There we go. Both of you are done, and scavenging level up. One second here while we ride over. Um, I do want to let you guys know, though, on YouTube, if you do want to watch this series uh, alive, I do stream this on Twitch, uh, usually Monday, uh, Mondays and Fridays at the moment. I do have a, a variety stream of of something of another game uh, that I just started this this week. So, yeah. But looking at the base here, I still need to upgrade this uh, door to iron and a full forged iron. I want it to be maximum strength possible. And we got all the the lovely scrap iron hatches uh, looking nice. Um. And then we have I've started building up the the second the second layer of of the base, you know. Well, this is only the first half. Did start doing the uh the other bit of foundation work uh overnight or in one of the previous episodes. So yeah, we're you know, we're making slow but sure progress. I this base is at least feeling safe enough to you know, do some do some board fighting at at the very least. There are some parts I want to hunt down for weapons. Like eventually, I do want to find the AK uh, parts. I think I only have the receiver, if I'm remembering correctly. Good morning, Psycho Steve. And also, I want to get the get the sniper rifle. Uh, Get a sniper rifle going, you know, at least have that all going. Maybe eventually get some magnum parts, which... Well, I do have full magnum, but speaking of the magnum, let's actually invest into skill points, the last little quick crafting, and we can invest into 44 magnum crafting at the moment. We have to do one more level up. We're actually really close to level 94, so we're actually... I'm gonna be able to get shotgun shells unlocked. But yeah, um, maybe do a little bit of looting a little later in the day uh, after I collect resources. 
but um, also, it's like, I think, uh, I don't really want to use too much ammunition on the, on the SMG for Fortnite if I don't have to. I want it to be kind of a last resort. Um, so, but that's why I'm wanting to keep the blunderbuss going. You kind of keep it as like a crowd control weapon. But yeah, so I'm going to collect some stone and iron again to the forge in my little mine. And I will be uh, back with you guys on YouTube in just a little bit. Well, YouTube, I'm done doing my resource gathering for for now on iron. Got plenty of stone and to make uh, and I got over 800 iron to smelt into the forge. Uh, so we should be looking all right for now on that front. And you know, want to do some raiding for the day to keep us a little busy. I know it's a little like what I was saying earlier. Those I'm thinking after board time is like, yo, know, why I'm saving all the SMG ammo is I want to try to go and raid Hub City. I know it's like, yo, know, it hasn't worked out too well for me in the past with my kind of, you know, enabling permadeath and all that, but I figured, yo, know, wouldn't be, you know, since like, I mean, I've already died like, what, 12 times in this series and I really don't, I really don't care about death. It, I'm just kind of like, at some point, you know, gotta go raid Hub City. It's a, it's a good, it's a good little raid, and no matter how many dogs, and I'm thinking I should probably, uh, I'm currently, I was currently making a uh, blunderbuss ammunition to, to keep myself uh, busy, and you know, just kind of get, get some, get some stuff rolling along, and you know, hope to have that. Done and everything. Just cruising around town here really quickly to see if there's any POIs I have. Just not, just not scratch the, uh, scratched for, um, you know, for a raid. And well, we're generally looking, we're generally looking kind of dry for, for raids. It's like. I already read the, read the safe in this town, and, well, I'm thinking, you know, could be a little bit of a fun, we could, uh, take a look down this gravel road. And while we're driving down this gravel road, um, the, I was gonna say, is like, you know, I did mention earlier that I do have, like, a little bit of, could start doing a, Rave live stream, and you know, if you watch my channel for a while, you'll know that I say uh, that I I keep the I like to keep the old uh, keep the seven days uh, I'll keep the YouTube channel here for seven days content pretty much exclusively, and and it's like I start I decided like um, to start doing a little bit of writing on my Twitch channel, like yo. So um, currently it's. It's, uh, like, uh, I started doing, playing the Dying Light for Twitch and everything like that. I don't record it because, like, I kind of want to keep the variety stuff as a Twitch channel exclusive. I know, uh, some people, yo, know, if you, because, like, I know, like, yo, know, although my subscribers, <laughs> My amount of subscribers is small, it's say on YouTube. It's like uh I figured on Twitch you know, the variety would help it a little bit. And so uh we're just clearing out a bunch of zombies here, you know. Got the usual riff raft, you know. I figured we can just raid this little house here and as you can see my spike club is just doing really good work here and just Clearing, uh, clearing zombies out. It's the highest, uh, well, highest tier club in the game. And oh, we got Crawler. He wants to have a, a word with me. Come here. He, if I hit him in the head, I can actually even hit one shot the crawlers. Even the Mikeys. 
That's kind of weird, referring to him in plural, but come here. Yeah, if, sometimes it'll count as a upper body shot, but, you know, it, it is what it is. We got, well, we got green alcohol, some blood bags, that was probably a nurse. Hey, some extra ammunition. 44 magnum and, and, um, 9 millimeter ammunition. Happy to see that. And, you know, find decent loot. And, you know, it's just usual zombie, but, uh, zombie loot, but as you can see, it's like sometimes they drop some good stuff. Occasionally. We got another challenge. We got the man eater. Well, that would, probably would have been a nice little little challenge to have just before taking out every zombie in the local vicinity. In the vicinity. Get my SMG back down here. Um, just checking all these zombie bodies. Yeah, like I was saying though, you can sometimes like sometimes zombies will just drop some good loot. Oh, the fourth Mikey. Yep. Uh, a little bit of wood from you. I'll just search the zombie here. That was a nurse. And we'll just check around back just to be absolutely sure that we have all the all the zombies uh, hanging out. Um. Well. Okay, yeah, we're cleared out. Sometimes I thought sometimes I hear I I think I hear zombies or anything, and it's like it don't help with uh, that I have uh, my hearing ain't the greatest. Like, long story short, I have tinnitus. It it I'm always hearing ringing in my ears, and sometimes I mistake it for a zombie. In this game, I think it's just a. But no, thankfully not. It's like. Uh, or unfortunately not, depending on how you feel it. Um, getting some more junk and some more brass and all that. You know, good, nice to see that we're getting some resources out of this. Uh, a little bit of beer and, and some raw meat, which I'll take. There was nothing in that bookcase, I don't believe. And not much in this little little house. Uh, I did raid the bird's nest. Wanted to make Jack absolutely sure. But yeah, like, with what I was saying earlier, though, it's like, yo, know, I love writing at Twitch, it's like, yo, know, if some of you ask, like, yo, know, why I don't do, like, the variety stuff on YouTube, it's kind of like, because I, even though I've been around for only four months, well, like, well, for a couple months now on YouTube, it's, it's one of those, because I've been uploading seven days content mainly, it's, Primarily for, it's primarily because uh, it's like I would love to up upload other zombie games, uh, but the the problem being is it's it's a matter of like kind of like a built my built my audience to you know, you know, built my subscriber base off of Seven Days to Die and everything like that and well Seven Days and you know and it's like I don't you know don't want I don't want to disappoint those of you, but also at the same time, it's a... Hey, a padlock. I don't need it, though. If it was higher quality, I'd take it. It's one of those, it's a... I'm sure you've heard plenty of people, uh... Going on about it, like, you know, before and everything like that, but, um... It's one of those, it's a... It's a... It's a matter of the algorithm, and it's like, although I have not very big of a reach for my videos on YouTube, it's sometimes they get like the Horde Night videos do pretty well, but it's like it's one of those the algorithm. If you don't know, it's like you kind of stray off your little kind of niche of content. It's like sudden, most likely like um, YouTube's algorithm will punish you as a creator. Like I say, I don't, I don't try to, I, I don't like bringing that stuff in, but it's like, you know, it's a, it's a matter of, like, you know, trying to keep the, because, like, YouTube will punish me for it, and it really sucks. And it's like, uh, but I honestly don't know. Okay.
just check out the, these zombies here. Yo, got a little bit of a campsite while doing that that rambling. Got a couple shotgun shells and some steel arrows. Uh, take care of Charlie boy there. Uh, alrighty. I'll just throw out that nitrate and all that. We'll throw that splint out. More sham sandwiches. It's a... It's like, uh, so common. We got hunting rifle parts, pistol receiver, uh, pistol receiver, and shotgun parts. Um, uh, where's my mini bike at? Ah, there it is. Yeah, it. So, kind of as I do want to do variety stuff, and it's like I'm wondering to myself whether or not I should do it on this YouTube channel because how harsh YouTube can be. It's like, uh, like I say, I would love to do it, but I'm honestly, I honestly don't know. It's like, I, I do kind of want to keep my mainly seven days. Hey, a nice script for the Magnum. And some extra 9 mil. We got extra flashlight and and we got another hunting rifle receiver. Find some decent stuff in here. And it's like, keep in mind when I say like variety, it's like, I'm not, it's like I've, I've loved zombie games for many, for, for a long time and, and it's like, there are, there is a certain, um, let's just say, series uh, that I will not, it's like, that I just don't want to play. For YouTube's sake, it's just a... Because it's one of those, um... What to say, it's on the downturn. And it has been for a while. I'm not going to mention it. But, yeah. Um, we're just traveling over to this little house here. I don't think there's much in this one, but... We should at least find, uh... We should at least get all the... Get some more looting done. Yeah, just a little bit of fun chatting. Bob, come on over. Oh, we already got the the man eater done. That zombie's real. That challenge is really easy to do. It's like, you know, kind of was just just find them really easy and all that. Um, come here. I know you want to go down. There you go. Alrighty. Just check over here. Charlie's done. Nurse. Yeah, really just whacking these zombies. It's like, you know, satisfying to have a have the top tier club in this version. You, you. There we go. I probably won't increase the difficulty from uh, on uh, after Horde Night because one of those is like, I'm already trying to get used to, just trying to remain used to the, what do you call it, um, I think this is warrior difficulty if I remember correctly, it's the third highest on this version. You know, just trying to kind of keep myself, uh, cause this big guy here, and also the dogs hit hard enough on, uh, on this, uh, on this uh, difficulty. Come on. There you go, curly boy. Got suck a Steve. Yep. Don't you just love it when you hit the braiding hood blade of grass, but kinda like I'm already trying to get used to this and I think I'm happy with this. It's like kinda like if I don't <laughs> I don't feel too overpowered, but at the same time I I'm pretty happy with this difficulty. And so we'll remain on it for a while. Maybe eventually we'll step it up a little bit on the on the uh, on zombie difficulty. I don't plan on making it. Um, how do you say? Sorry, brain for here. I don't plan on having it be cranked up to to um, like uh. uh Always sprinting. Oh, oh yeah, that that makes sense. 
I was thinking to myself, oh damn, there's a wasteland. Uh, but... Um... I, I'm not surprised. It's... It's down to the south and everything like that. Not really that surprising. So yeah, I do have some cement crafting at the base and everything, and I do have iron... I did have that iron smelting, so... I'm gonna make my way back over to town and... And get myself, uh... And we'll see what kind of upgrades we can do. Check in with you a little bit, YouTube. Well, YouTube, I've come back to base here. I'm, uh, just... And I heard a screamer, uh, roaming in here. And she's just... She's trying to take a seat, but... Go away. Bye-bye. Oh, thank you. She sandwich. Just while I was uh, always wanted a screamer. Yeah, I was just coming over to check up on the... It's like, well, I was just bringing up, uh, bringing my, get some forged iron craft, and wanted to check to see if there was any zombies. Oh, what'd you look at that? Another screamer. Come on. Oh, let's see if we can try and take care of her. Definitely want to move out of this place. Uh, Eh, go ahead and scream. It's it's no worries. Come on, get up. <laughs> Just sit her back into the sun face. That's hilarious. Whoop. We'll just send you back. And here comes our company. Is it just you, Penny? No, of course it's not. Well, your head's gone. Looking. Well, would you look at that? Another screamer. Seems like they're coming in from the northwest this time around. Take care of Curly. We'll take care of his brothers too. Alright, why are you back here? Go away. You can take your head with you to the afterlife. Take care of old Bob there. Come on. Let's take care of you guys. We'll take care of him. Let's see enough. I'll take you. There you go. You're taken care of. Sounds like one of the corpses decided to not exist anymore. We got level 96. We do have two extra skill points for the, uh, uh for the, oh, what am I trying to say here? We do have two extra skill points because of the Manier Challenge. Let's see you later, Crawler. Um, we'll just do a little patrol here, make sure we're not seeing more screamers. That's the last thing we need out of this, uh, out of this place, uh, more screamers, but... Uh, do a little bit of a patrol. I mean, at least it gives me time to make the, the last of the forged iron I need, but... I think... We're clear for now. It's on for now, because the screamers will... Just keep a chasing. Well, I hear one more, but really not that big of a deal. We got more. We got more of that rolling in. More, more cement. So, yeah, we're looking. Uh, we're looking good on making more concrete mix. I digress. Um, iron staying to cooking in the forge and. I was just wanting to check up on that yes, solar forge and all our cement is coming along nicely. And we'll actually grab all our sand and concrete mix too. Well, oh, sand and stones to make our concrete mix just to see. That'll be fine. And just see how much more we got. Another basically 800. On, on the craft, ready to go. Oh look, more company. Let's just take care of them really quickly. Where are you guys at? And also, did I ever... Huh! I never checked, I never checked the safe in this place. I can't believe I ever did, I never did that. Come here, Curly. Come here. There you go. Take your nap, and just leave me alone, please. There we are. So yeah, um, 
I just want to take care of this nurse. Make sure our territory is just taken care of for the most for the time being. Come here. Can't stand when the nurses do that stuff. Like uh, the zombies do that. They just kind of slowly twirl around. Uh, but let's get some. Let's get some. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do a little bit of building off the camera here and. And I'll show you the progress, YouTube. Well, YouTube, I've done some more upgrades, like with the concrete that I took out of the cement mixer. And I'm just placing more rebar frames. All this concrete that you see here is freshly laid and everything, and we've done some more upgrades to the base here. And, oh, pick that up. But yeah, it's getting close to nighttime here. We'll... I'll build up the rest of this for you, just to show you. I did sprain my leg because I accidentally ran off the top of one of the corners. Clumsy me, but it's a... It's really no biggie. I'll get it healed up before Ford night. Before I do anything dumb, um, I want to make sure I take that rebar frame out just so I can... Upgrade our cornerstone blocks and everything like that. It's a... You know, I think I should have most of this ready and done by... By Horde Knight. You know, we might even get to start moving in before Horde Knight comes in. Depends on how how quickly I get, get my concrete mix going. Which I should have it done overnight. Like, get it all crafted. But yeah. Ow. Uh, that'll be about it for today's episode. Hopefully this will be all upgraded in the morning for you. So, YouTube, I hope you enjoyed today's episode, and I thank you all so much for watching. Have a great day.